In this video, let's talk about China's most shocking military technologies in action. But what you are going to see here is something that is at another level. In this video, you will see the most unbelievable actual footages of live fire tests of China's most advanced long-range missiles. If you are new in this channel, click the subscribe button on below and hit the bell icon for you to stay updated with our latest videos. In this video, you will see the most unbelievable actual footages of live fire tests of China's most advanced long-range missiles. And without further ado, let's get right to our video. Number 1 is China's PHL-03 Long-Range Multiple Rocket Launcher. This is China's PHL-03 long-range multiple rocket launcher. It is a 12-tube 300mm MLR, mainly for destroying strategic group targets like troops, airfields, and command centers. It can also be used to engage in counter-battery fire missions. With long range, high precision, and firepower, it has greatly improved the artillery troops' remote fire support and precision strike capabilities. The MLR has greatly enhanced the remote fire support capability of the Chinese military. Number 2 is Chinese Rocket Force Brigade Tests New Type Missiles. A missile brigade of the Chinese People's Liberation Army Rocket Force launched two new type missiles to accurately hit targets hundreds of kilometers away during a recent training in desert to improve the soldiers' rapid response capabilities. After maneuvering to the launch location in the desert in northwest China at night, the launch unit erected the missile launcher into position and set the launch parameters upon receiving order. According to a senior engineer of the brigade, they spent the most efforts on shortening the technical procedure in firing the missiles to improve the rapid response capabilities. The missiles hit the targets accurately in respective launches. Number 3 is First Surface-to-Air Missile Live Fire Exercise Marine Corps from China and Thailand conducted their first joint live fire exercise involving surface-to-air missiles at Satahip Naval Base, the largest naval base in Thailand. Officers say all seven missiles fired by the two sides hit their targets. The military training is part of Blue Strike 2016 a joint drill involving the Chinese and Thai Marines that got underway. The military drill is the third one of its kind, following the Blue Strike 2010 and Blue Strike 2012 joint training exercises. Number 4 is Chinese Rocket Force launches new missiles in northwest China's desert. Recently, a missile unit of the Chinese People's Liberation Army Rocket Force successfully launched two missiles in the recent combat drill under extreme conditions in the desert area of northwest China. The report identifies the missiles as DF-26 Intermediate Range Ballistic Missile. 
This is the first time the launch of a DF-26 missile and detailed images of it have been made public. Some international media have questioned the DF-26 ability to hit a moving vessel, saying China had never practiced attacking such a target. The recent exercise demonstrated the missile's capability, according to a military expert. Number 5 is Chinese PLA Missile Regiment Holds Drills A naval missile regiment of the Chinese People's Liberation Army Eastern Theater Command recently conducted a drill to enhance their abilities of quick response, maneuver, and striking. Upon receiving the order, the soldiers and officers quickly gathered and then maneuvered to the designated area by military vehicles. After reaching the destination, they set up camouflage using bombs and transferred their equipment to a secret area the second they spotted the reconnaissance aircraft of the enemy. Later, they quickly maneuvered to the launch site to launch the missiles. The deputy chief of staff of the regiment said they will continue to strengthen the troops' combat abilities. Number 6 is China Tests Hypersonic Aircraft Starry Sky 2. China has successfully tested a cutting-edge hypersonic aircraft that rides its own shock waves. During the flight, the test craft maintained ultra-fast speeds above Mach 5.5 for more than 400 seconds and reached 7,344 km per hour, according to report. The Wave Rider is similar to a technology being developed by the US and Russia, and they could be fitted with conventional or nuclear warheads, defense analysts say. Its speed and a predictable trajectory will challenge modern missiles defense systems. So, I hope you found this video wonderful, and if you did, be sure to press the like button. And if you want this kind of content, be sure to subscribe and click the bell icon. Thanks for watching and see you in our next content.